How you doing, guys? Welcome back to Gear Guitars with Mel. I am Mel. Let me fix this a little bit. Oh, I popped it off. I busted it. So I wanted to do this video because I did say in another video that, hey, I got this, uh, this guitar that needs some loving. Well, it's received all the love. So what I did, this is the first Harley Benton CST 24T that I ever got. Went out to my god sister for a while, spent some time in uh, South Carolina, and uh, I just, just got it wired up. And uh, she wasn't playing it too much, so I snagged her back. Um, and I just wanted to show that, man, simple will work. You know what I'm saying? Uh, pickups, they're uh, antique, uh, the Fat Pats from Guitar Fetish. Uh, I went with the whole quick plug system, including switch, just so that I could, uh, first of all, test it out and see if it was any good. And I feel like it's pretty dang good. One second. Sorry about that. Drop my pick. But, uh, so yeah, I wanted to get this bad girl back to life since I'm going to be doing some gigging. I want to make sure that I have competent instruments all around because I've uh, had a lot of pieces. Oh man, look at that top. But yeah, and I'm just going straight through my Bugera V55. Uh, I haven't even changed the uh, tubes out yet, so it's not even all awesome like that. You know what I mean? So we'll just go through some quick tones. <laughs> down the bridge. This is the middle position. it up normal with the quick plug but I decided to give it a little kill switch engage that makes it nice and quiet but um I just wanted to show that you know you get guitars sometimes this wasn't an overly expensive guitar but it played good had a good neck I really liked it nice little D shape on it so far you know I'm a fan of all the Harley Benton stuff but it went out, you know, got out of circulation, you know, left the state, went down to the bottom half of the country, you know, and that was after I put some P90s in it and took out the pickups that were in it. I'm cutting myself all off here, man. This is like bad YouTube etiquette. But uh, I just decided, like, you know what? Let's put some new stuff in here. Let's see how she plays. I got a couple of guitars I'm doing for some friends right now, and uh, 
this was a quick one that I could just get in there and see if I can make it sound good. I, I'm a fan. I'm going to tell you, I'm a fan of these fat pads. They're, uh, they're not too bad. So this is literally just a quick, don't give up on your guitars. You know what I mean? If you got one and it's, you're not playing it as much as you used to, dude, give it a setup. Throw some new pickups in it. Get a new bridge. Find a way to make yourself want to play it again. You know what I mean? You can't bail on these things. This is all we got. And besides, isn't that nice? Oh, look at that. Got my little old man Angel Vivaldi vibe on the pickups. And that was why I went with the white. <laughs> But that's it, nothing important. Just to let you know I'm still here, still working on content. Uh, got a massive pedal board video, you wanna see, you wanna see? Hold on. Massive pedal board video coming. But I'm having a problem with my signal chain right now, so I don't know what the deal is with that. And then we also gotta get the, uh, gotta get the Bouguera retubed. I think that'll be a good video. I think I'm gonna uh, do that one as a how-to uh, for all you cats out there that are rocking the Bougueras. Let's see my girl, where she at? There she is. Oh, look at her. But yeah, that's about it, man. I just wanted to pop in and say, if you got a guitar that you don't rock anymore, or you don't rock like you used to, just don't give up on it. Find some way to make it like There was a reason that you got it to begin with, right? And for me, I go through a lot of guitars. And I mean a lot of guitars, okay? But there's just some that keep me calling back. And if you notice, if you watch my videos over over the past couple years, you'll see that there's a few that just don't go anywhere. This one went, came back, I don't know if it's going anywhere again. I think uh, this pretty old cherry sunburst might have to hang out. Look at that flame, bro. Ooh. But yeah, that's it. Don't give up on your axes, man. Thanks for hanging out Gears Guitar with Mel. I'm Mel, and we'll check you guys later on.